How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawlhalla for you today as always. Hope you're all having a beautiful day, wherever you might be. So I'm going to show off some of the new stuff that I got today uh, from the Battle Pass. I completed most of my week 3 missions. The only ones I have left are be the first player to pick up an item and grab to cancel or slide charge side signature KOs. I was doing it wrong this whole time. I thought you just had to get any gravity cancel signature KO, but it, I learned <laughs> it has to be a side signature. So we'll work on that. But what I got on the battle pass that I haven't shown yet in a video at the very least are the flintlock claws. I mean, you've seen me unlock them maybe, but I didn't actually use them yet. And also the prideful roar lion. Or Prideful Roar Bow, which looks like a face of a lion on the bow, which is really cool. Uh, so, I mean, blasters, bow, bow and blasters, obviously Diana, right? Diana has both. So let's look at the, uh, the new bow, if I can find it. There it is, alright. And look at how it looks in different colors, I bet you didn't expect half of the bow to be a... Dang it, I didn't mean to, oh my gosh. All right, let me go back to it. Okay, I was gonna say, I bet you didn't know that half the bow is a different color. I didn't know that. How cool is that? Ooh, man, Gala looks so cool. The, I knew this bow was gonna be way cooler looking with colors. Okay, missed opportunity. It should have been half black, half red on that. Oh well, all the other colors look pretty awesome. So let's use this bow. Uh, I don't really want to use default colors to be honest. It just looks so good in Goldforge. And then let's try the new blasters. I know they don't look that cool, but they are something different. So let's try them out at least once. These ones, yeah, flintlock claws, right? These are the new blasters. All right, so let's play a game with the new bow, the new blasters. I'm probably gonna play uh, a few games actually. <laughs> I, I, I won't play Diana the whole time though. We're just doing Diana this first game because she has both. After that, I'm probably just gonna use different bow legends to be honest, because I'm not really a blaster main. I do I, I do fine with blasters, but it I don't know. They're just kinda not my favorite weapon, you know what I mean? Alright, we're going against Andy playing Orion. Let's see how we do. Diana. Oh, I can't wait to get Soulbound Diana. We're not even close. Could I buy all the tiers and just unlock her right now? Yes, I could, but I don't want to. I like earning them, you know, by completing missions and whatnot. To me, that's that's where the fun is. Oops, all right. Let's try to remember how to play Diana. It's been a little bit since I played her, so... Once we get warmed up, though, I got a feeling we will be on fire. This guy is hard to hit, and he's pretty good at, like, hitting me. Whoa, he almost killed me. Almost. Psych. Ooh, I dodged. Oh. Oh, sniped. Ooh, I'm surprised he didn't get back there. That weapon throw was all I needed. Dang, this bow looks so good. And you guys notice I'm using the uh, Lion Guard Diana skin. Or whatever it's called, I don't remember, but it's basically the Order of the Exalted Lion Diana skin. Dude is going for those down sips like crazy. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, I wanted to do a gravity cancel down sig there. Nice. D what is that? Down helicopter, I call it. <laughs> uh oh. I need a weapon. This guy's not bad. I mean, Orion is a good legend. Let's not forget that. Some people may spam sigs with him, but if you actually use him right, he is a pretty dang good legend. I like how he is playing so... he or she. Oh, it's Andy, right? Andy's pretty much a boy name. They're playing so aggressive. Oh! Off the screen! That felt good. Oh! I just noticed these blasters actually look amazing. They're also like the bow where they're different colors. You wouldn't even know, looking at their default colors, that these weapons look really cool in other colors. Ooh, he almost got me. Oh yeah, you want some of this, Orion? Oh, never mind, he don't. Oh! Bop! GG, dude, GG. 
Hey, we got a two stock. Feels good. Feels good. I hope you guys enjoy this content. If you do, please drop a like. It really helps the channel out. All right, you know what, guys? I've been uh, I've been itching to play Kaya, and I do have Code of Lions. So let's see what the. Uh, uh, man, I have. Let's use the Glacier's Grace. It goes well with Kaya because she has like ice signatures, you know. But let's see what this bow looks like with the Code of Lions. Maybe I'll use a Blaster Legend next time. I don't know. I'm not really a huge fan. Ooh. All right. So it's got kind of like a reddish top and then the the silver bottom. All right. I don't remember their names, but I know people have been asking me to play Kaya, so I hope they watch this video. All right, going against... I have no idea what that means, but we're going against Diana. Their name is like a sentence. All right, let's go... Oh, she... Oh, no, no. I'm letting you get the weapon. Bow versus bow. Let's go. All right. Kaya! Off stage? Oh. Who's got the better bow off stage? Let's find out. Oh, man. And you are toast. No? So close. How many times do I have to kill you to dick? Make you dead. <laughs> no, I didn't get it. Hold that. This time. No. Oh, so close. Man, she likes to live life on the edge. Fighting off the edge, rather. Literally, this whole game has almost been off the stage. All right, now we're gonna do some on-stage fighting. Let's go. Snow Owl, right your face. Off stage again? You haven't learned your lesson? Oh, again. Hey, I give her credit. You're never gonna hit those if you never go for them. You know what I mean? You have to not be afraid, but at the same time, don't be a little bit too crazy, like. She's, she's a little too crazy trying to live on the edge. Especially with Diana. Diana's not really an edge guard type of legend. I mean, Bo is okay off the stage, but uh, Blasters, are, yeah, they're okay, but they're not like great. So if you have Blasters or Bo, it's probably just best to stay on stage most of the time. That's just my advice. Um, let's see. I wanna do another Bo legend. Like, I feel like I don't do Bo. Actually, let's play Kaya. Or, I mean, Yumiko. <laughs> I call her Kaya. I have Code of Lions for Yubiko, so we could do that. I also have Esports version 2. Let's try that, because we haven't seen the bow in Esports version 2 colors yet. I got a feeling it's going to be good. There we go. For the hammer, let's do something that maybe fits the theme. I mean, what am I doing? A uh, little Yumiko? Oh, okay, so we need a cute looking hammer. Um... Actually, let's use this one. It's the lion, lion's guard hammer. It, it's called the Sterling Sledge, but it goes with the uh, the Nash Silver Mane Nash skin, which is basically uh, Order of the Lion hammer. So, Order of the Exalted Lion hammer and the Exorder of the Exalted Lion bow. Even though Yumiko didn't get an OEL skin, we're still making her. An OEL legend. <laughs> Is this the same person? Wait. I, I don't even know. I mean, it's another sentence name. I think it's the same person. I didn't look that closely at the first one. Maybe it's not. It might be a different person. Ooh. I'm already liking the way they're moving. They move kind of fast. Ooh. Yumiko is so fun to me. I love you missing Yumiko. Yes, I do use her six a lot, but that's because they're so good. Like, why would you not? Hold that. I want the bow. Oh, yeah. It looks good. Also, I suck with hammer, so I try to avoid it. <laughs> oh, yeah. She dodged up, and we got that perfect read there. But with Yubiko, 
Her hammer sigs make up for it. Like, I don't have to be that good with hammer if they're just gonna run into the sigs. Oh, oh! Edge guarding, not my best. Oh! She's in red! Oh! Come on up! I'm not done with you yet, Val. Watch the little blue balls! They will be deadly! Yeah, I don't know which color I like the best on this bow, but the fact that it has two colors literally makes it so much better. If it was just that one color, I would not really like it as much. Alright, I'm not hitting her there with those neutralized, but I will eventually because she keeps floating in that spot. If they're doing it, I mean... Oh, she... Oh! Woo! She... She... No! She KO herself! If they float above you a lot, which gauntlet players tend to do, don't be afraid to bow neutral light like forever because even though it's hard to hit kind of, honestly it's the best defense you got against somebody who likes to float. I usually follow up a neutral light with a recovery. Get a quick one two usually. Oh yeah, I love doing that one as well. Down sig into recovery. You could also do down sig into neutral sig sometimes. Oh, oh, she's in red. Oh, that was clean. It would have been cleaner if I actually got the first down air, but it's all good. Uh, GG, dude, GG. Oops, not trying to report you. <laughs> all right, let's do at least one more game. Wait, be the first player to pick up an item. Okay, I keep forgetting to do the gravity to cancel the side sigs. Like, oh, man. All right, uh, let's do one more game with a bow legend. Man, I haven't played Vector in a video in forever, so I am gonna play Vector. Let's see Skyforge. I love that lance, so we're using it. I also love the Yokai lance. Both of these are amazing. Let's use Yo Yokai. And then for the bow, I think it's this way. Wait. There we go. We'll see the Skyforged bow, and this lance also looks awesome. A lot of people hate on Vector because they think he's just a legend for six spammers to use. Meanwhile, Vector is actually an amazing legend in my opinion. Like, amazing. Possibly, possibly even a top 10 legend, but I would, I don't know. I'd have to really think about it. Uh, but yeah. Going against Mike, playing as more Dex. <laughs> I want to say Mike Dex at first. Mike going against. A Vector. Bardex and Vector. Alright. Gauntlets versus Lance. I'm actually not as scared of Lance or Gauntlets when I have a Lance because Lance outreaches. And once you get going, you can just get tons of damage just like a Gauntlet player can. We just gotta watch out for those grabs. If he hits us on a recovery, we're dead. Oh, oh, oh! Got him! Didn't even have to actually hit him. He was just scared of the ground pound. All right, let's look at the bow. Oh wow, the blue top looks so beautiful. I gotta say, the bow looks the best in Skyforge or Goldforge. Those both look the best to me. Ooh, I almost had that ground pound. He's doing all right with the scythe, but I mean, okay. Okay, Bordex, neutral sig, kinda OP there on the scythe, but okay, we got you to yellow anyways. Oh, sniped on the, uh, the mine throw there. Uh oh. Oh yeah, I got a lot of range here, Mordex. You can't outrange this ship. Oh yeah, baby. Woo! No, 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 you cannot escape. I love that. Woo! Lance is so good. When did I get good with Lance? I don't even know. Time to finish it out strong. Notice how I don't need to hit with that side sig for it to be useful. A lot, oops. A lot of times it's useful just to get back on stage. Oh! That slide off would have been awesome. No! My, my command did not come out fast enough. That's okay. Oh, where you go, Mike? Uh-oh. I gotta be careful here. Gauntlet's off stage. 
Bye bye. <laughs> Normally I'd be scared fighting a Bordax off stage, but Vector is just that good. GG though, dude. GG, Mike. That was actually a close game. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I just wanted to show you the new stuff I got in the Battle Pass. I'm still trying to get that last couple missions, but we got a, uh, quite a bit of time. Five days before the next set of missions, so I'm not in a rush. But yeah, tier 31, baby. Let me know what you guys are. And as always, this is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy, friends.